Over 3,000 people have been displaced in central Nigeria after at least 85 people were killed in ongoing clashes between herders and farmers, officials said Thursday. The violence erupted on Monday, May 15th, with an initial death toll of 30 in several villages of Plateau State, an area which has struggled with ethnic and religious tensions for years. Several villages in the Mangu district of Plateau State were still caught up in the violence on Thursday with residents fleeing according to local sources and witnesses. The crisis is just one of the many security challenges facing President-elect Bola Tinubu, who takes the helm of Africa's most populous nation later this month. It was unclear what triggered this week's attacks in Imangu, but tit-for-tat killings between herders and farmers often spiral into village laid by heavily armed guns. 85 bodies recovered. The chairman of the local government council, the port minister Daniel told AFP. Joseph Guancat, a community leader development association, gave the same toll. A search and rescue team discovered 85 dead bodies. The National Emergency Management Agency said thousands of people were displaced and hundreds of houses destroyed as a result of the violence. We got a total number of 3,683 people displaced. Ijeni Nyelong, regional coordinator at Neymar, told AFP, saying that emergency relief was on its way to those in need. More than 720 houses were either partially or completely destroyed, he added. The number of people injured was still unclear as of Thursday. Gwankat, the community leader, said that 57 injured people were being treated in hospitals, while Nyelong from Neymar said an estimated 216 people had been injured in the attacks. Police said that five people had been arrested in connection with the violence. Heavy security presence has been deployed. Police spokesperson Alfred Alabo said so far calm has been restored to the general areas.